To produce a real quality video, the most important thing, believe it or not, is not just the video, it's the sound, and for that you need a good mic. So let's talk about today the Shotgun V30 Pro. And today let's talk about mics when you do video recording. Uh, many they start recording video they don't think like the mic is the most important thing we'll think okay i want to get uh, uh, a 4k camera and do that real good recording but if you record a video and you have the echo in the background you got this wind noise and you got all these things in the background or when you're recording the video it's not going to make any sense and actually you can record and i wonder if we see that sometime in youtube they do this wonderful video but the sound sounds terrible and most of the people will drop the video and no longer listen to the video because it's some quality so it's really like a radio you want it's something you want a good mic one way to do it i use it for my camera and i carry this way what is nice for this if you're going to interview somebody you are in the streets and you want to you know record questions from people whatever you're a youtuber that will be the easy way right you go like this and maybe somebody does a record it and you talk with your guests so they get the straight sound with this now if you are on the street you're going to get two different sounds you're going to get traffic sound and wind sound now the way to do it a few things to do it and let me change camera so i can show you this so from here it requires two double a batteries the two double a batteries will last for 200 hours so that's plenty recording to turn it on is pretty easy you just put it right in the metal and then you got the green light when it becomes red it will let you know you gotta replace the battery now right in the middle is 10 plus decibels but if you go where it says on you see you switch for the second right that's a normal recording but if you need more then you do 10 decibels if you're pretty light let me show you the mic you can use this if you feel only but in my case i always i want you to because this will stop some of the noise now also it has a cutoff filter and this is the cutoff filter this is soft right now you can turn it on now it will cut off anything below 80 hertz so when you turn it on the idea to cut off anything below 80 hertz so anything like traffic wind noise or even if you sometimes you have that problem in my case i run this in the manual mode because if I run the auto focus in this, it's kind of noisy. You hear like, you know, plus when you do a recording, it keeps moving. So in my case, I turn it off, I do manual, and I just move it from, from here, and that's it. But that case, if you want to do it automatically, you want to make sure when you do the video, you don't get that type of noise. So the way to do it is you get the cut off. Now, make sure you test the sound because sometimes if you cut off or if you are too far, your voice will go like a uh, it will cut off your voice too so very important something like in my case i, I use a compressor so if the compressor is too low and my voice it, it drop it will start cut off and it's pretty simple to put real light so you just put in your camera i'll show you another way that you do that too now the next thing is the famous dead cut and that's uh what they call it is this now with this let me go back and change cameras again now with this, you're gonna use this in case there is a lot of winds. So the way to do it, you're gonna insert the way it is like this. What I'm gonna do, let me change cameras again so you guys can see this right. And then just grab this and just go over. It has to get strong, okay? So you have to, all right, that's it. And then you go just go like this and you got it that's the way that's the right way to do it right it looks really nice and this is the color yeah dead cat that's that's the name i guess industry that's what they call it so we can put it right in the camera and that's it if you can change the camera and the front it looks pretty cool but that you're going to use this if you really had a lot of wind and that way you don't need to do the cutoff without the cutoff you, you have to feel you have to be outdoor and see how that records and when the end we're going to do a little test audio test no video now one way 
If I do this, then it's pretty cool. Now, what else you can use this? Now, let's say you don't got this camera. Now, you have a cell phone. Now, if you had a cell phone, you know, cell phone didn't have a good mic. So if you want to do a good recording with this, you do this. If you have like a good selfie stick, in my case, let me see what the selfie stick is at. You can use like they do, you see, in the movies. You use the selfie stick. You gotta make sure they have the adapter. So you put it here. You attach it here. Now, depends. My application, I have an Android phone. Mine is to have, uh, I still have the connector here. The 1.8 and the type of application I use allow me to switch internal mic and external mics. Sans phone by default won't allow you to do that. So when you do that, I use a long cable and I plug it here. So now I use this, right? Like you see in the movie, this is pretty long. So now somebody else, sometimes what we do, I can use the phone to record so we can use the phone to do the recording and this you just put in the top of the head or close to the person without see the mic so you get better sound or yes so far that's another way to record and this is a pretty cool idea you need a longer cable i do have a longer cable you plug it in there and that's a real cool way to do it a nice uh, recording or when you're recording or interview somebody and that's another cool way to do it Now, what else we get, as you see there, we get the manual to show you. It's pretty simple to show you how that works. And we get the, all the information you can scan and you get the, the little warranty card you want to send it out. So in the next section, what we're going to do now, we're going to play some uh, sound. What I'm going to do, I'm going to be recording actually in my phone. No video, right? Just a test. We're going to do the cutoff. I'm going to be playing some um, eddy, eddy horse noise and try to cut off and so you can hear the difference when I turn on uh, some eddy, something that will produce an eddy uh, horse noise. All right, so thank you very much. Now, to get more information on this product, we'll be right below the video. All right, so now I'm using just the phone. That's why normally I do my uh, video recording or interviews. I should show you in the video the way I use it with my selfie stick. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to plug the mic and we're going to try it first. All right. So this is normal operation uh, with a mic. I'm only about a foot away from the mic. But if you're going to use this, you're going to use for interview or whatever sound record, so you're going to be far. So let's move away. I'm using a ruler to measure the distance. Make sure it's straight from the mic. And right now I'm a five feet away, five feet, five feet, six feet away, seven feet away from the mic. Point it straight to my face. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna turn on 10 decibels. So that's 10 decibels. We can see the difference. So seven feet or six feet away. Six feet, seven feet, and right now I'm about 10 feet away. We can see uh, the difference. I'm going beyond, beyond my studio now. We can see the big difference. So now what I'm going to do, uh, what we're going to do now, we're going to turn on, let's put normal sound. I'm only a feet away, so let's go. Normal sound. Let's turn on some traffic in the background. I guess we can already hear the traffic. And I'm gonna turn on the cutoff switch and, and let's hear the difference. So, you can see the difference now. This is with the cut off switch. It's still a little bit recording, but not much. It cut off a lot. 
Now let's turn off the cutoff switch and this would the cutoff switch off. Oh, big difference, right? Alright, so with this we complete the test. Thank you.